our protective action should be good as they stand. Uh, what we probably need to worry about now is uh, dispersing the material so it doesn't create a... Defining uh, your response objectives and understanding your defensive options are critical steps in planning for a hazmat incident. In this program, you have learned about determining how to limit exposures with available resources, the steps to determine defensive objectives, assessing risk to responders, identifying your defensive options, and how to choose the correct control techniques. Hazmat incidents require extensive and accurate planning to maintain life safety for responders and the public. Clearly stating your objectives and understanding your options are major steps in formulating a plan and protecting your community.